Okay, so here I am in Tentramar Marsh, uh, New Brunswick, southeastern New Brunswick, right under the famous power lines that are going across this marsh. Uh, there's a communication, I mean a test tower over there, uh, right there for uh, windmills that are supposed to be going up here. And uh, as you can see, these communication towers, I mean the power towers, have uh, all kinds of wires going across the marsh. Just to show the proof that uh, it is uh, sometimes casualties for birds. This morning, uh, on the 29th of November, uh, I got here and uh, saw a mess of crows and ravens and even bald eagles fighting in this area. So I decided to come and check it out, knowing damn well what I was gonna find. A flock of uh, common eider seems to have uh, hit the wires last night. Uh, there is about the, the remains of about 10 carcasses of birds. Uh, so we can see the wings really well. And <coughs> web feet of eiders. Uh, as you can see, the crows and the ravens and the eagles didn't leave much. Uh, there is one male carcass there and I just have to walk a few feet to find remains of all kinds of others. Uh, there's a, a wing of a female here, uh, remains of a female here. Oh, this is this one is new. So, yeah, I guess that would put the, the total to much more. Oh, here we go. Well, that would prove that I'm what I'm talking about. Here we go. Common eiders, victim of NV Power's power lines. Well, any power lines, any guide wires are obstacles to migrating birds. It's really, really sad. What a beautiful sea duck these are. But there is a few carcasses around, pieces of wings everywhere. There's another one over there. And as you can see, we're still under, right, right, right under the power lines. There's another one here, another one there, there. There's also, I found another one right there in the grass. Uh, it's basically a, a real butchery here. These poor things must have hit the wires last night. Very fresh. Uh, oh, see, there's another another one here. I saw an eagle lifting one from, from here. There seems to have been one carcass that died here and another one that probably have died here. You can see the down. Eider down is very, very, very good uh, isolant, and uh, we use it, but it's better to take it from live eiders. Very sad, just goes to show that these windmills and these power lines are definitely a threat to birds.